Buenos días señores, hoy vamos a hablar del tiempo. Y cuando digo tiempo no hablo de los minutos, las horas, los segundos, sino hablo del tiempo que hace afuera. Cuando queremos saber del tiempo tenemos una pregunta y la pregunta es ¿qué tiempo hace? ¿Qué tiempo hace? Es la pregunta que nosotros hacemos cuando queremos hablar de la lluvia, de la niebla, del calor, etc. Preguntamos ¿qué tiempo hace? Ahora, vamos a ver hoy algunas expresiones que podemos usar para hablar del tiempo que hace. Welcome, once again. Today we're going to be talking about the weather. The word that we use for weather in Spanish is tiempo. Tiempo is a word that can also mean time. It's a word uh, that would refer to time in general. So if I say a long time, uh, much time, we use the word tiempo. But in this case, tiempo means weather. So when I say que tiempo hace, what I'm saying is essentially what is the weather? Literally, what weather does it make? Okay, but I'm asking, what's the weather? ¿Qué tiempo hace? We're going to look at the ways in which we express the weather. Sometimes uh, we're going to use this word hace to express the weather, talk about the weather, and other times uh, we'll do it in a slightly different way. Essentially, this is a vocab lesson, so this will be very quick. There are a bunch of expressions that we have in Spanish that will use hace, such as hace frío, meaning it's cold, Hace calor, meaning it's hot. Hace viento, meaning it's windy. And hace sol, meaning it's sunny. If we use any of these expressions, we can put in mucho before any of them to say, for instance, it's very cold, hace mucho frío. Notice, when we've spoken before uh, with the word frío, say, we've used it in a couple of different ways. We've talked about, say, a soup. We could say, la sopa está fría. Okay, so when we're talking about um, uh, something like that, something that's, that's not one of us, we can say it is cold, saying está frío or está fría. If we're talking about our own bodies, we say tengo frío. Tengo frío meaning I am cold. And if we want to talk about the weather, we say hace frío. Same with calor, right? We've seen calor with tengo calor. Tengo calor. Pero hace calor meaning it is hot. That's the weather. Um, so we've got those expressions. There are also certain expressions that we use verbs for. So, llueve is the stem changing form, third person singular, of the verb llover, spelled like this. <laughs> Perdón. Llover, which means to rain. So llueve means it is raining. Or we can say, está lloviendo, and put it into the present progressive form. Nieva is also a stem-changing verb. It's the verb nevar, meaning to snow. Okay, and está nevando, or nieva, means it is snowing. There are also certain expressions such as talking about fog. We say, there is fog. Hay niebla. Okay, niebla means fog. The noun forms of rain and snow would be lluvia and nieve, and they're both feminine. So la lluvia is the rain, la nieve is the snow. And that's all it is. That's all that's going on here. In a brief nutshell, this is how we talk about weather. So just remember the question, ¿Qué tiempo hace? ¿Qué tiempo hace? Pues hace frío. ¿Qué tiempo hace? Hace calor, ¿qué tiempo hace? Está nevando, ¿qué tiempo hace? Hay niebla. Okay. Real simple, that's it. Muchas gracias, hasta luego. Chao.